read an interesting uh, tweet from Greg Eisenberg about how the <clears throat> software developer jobs are down 70% compared to the peak. The middle class engineer is dying. People will blame the end of free money. He's talking about the low interest rates. The middle class engineer is dying, as you said, because they're not needed anymore. Here we go again with the AI hype. We have product builders who happen to code armed with AI. They ship entire products in days. Meanwhile, the truly elite engineers are making more money than ever. 2025 software engineer doesn't mean what it meant in 2020. This is what this chart really shows. And the chart is about the 70% drop from the peak, which was somewhere in 2022. Yeah, really. I saw it. Yeah. To be honest, when I read those type of tweets, also from mm. Greg Eisenberg, I do feel like he's always a little bit on the hype train, right? Yeah, well, I mean, his, his takes are quite spot on, mostly. Mostly, but what do you yeah. think about this one? Because doesn't it also depend on the level of complexity, the type of customers that yeah, you're... Yeah, but I think then you're already making the point. Because, for example, in ELA 5, we don't really hire juniors unless they're very talented. It's already too complex what we are doing. And if you look at building MVPs, for example, amazing that you can do it now with AI, right? But the more complex products, the things that we build, we have been using AI in the development team, but it's not having the same effect as it has in, a, in, in an MVP product, you mm -hmm. know? So I think he's right. And if you have a bunch of juniors that are basically just doing the crunch work, I can see why they are not that needed anymore. Yeah. 